the Avengers Endgame screening, the very first one in China, is at so much it's at it's at zero zero oh five. I got back last night at like I think eleven ish, and I just woke up. I haven't even like washed up yet. This has been a really tiring weekend. I lost a lot of sleep, but it was really exciting. I am very, very late for school. We have a our psych class room. wants to spend the last day of psych oh, with, oh, miss, no, with our psych teacher, but he has to go to a wedding, so now he's calling his best friend, who he's the best man of the wedding for, to ask him if he can cancel the wedding. Yeah, ask Kristen, see if she's, see if she's cool with that. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, you can make the projector into like Hawaii background. <laughs> we can like put some sand on the ground <laughs> from the sand cloth. Believe they graduate soon and these are their best ideas. <laughs> Go! See you Wednesday for our last class. The Avengers Endgame screening, the very first one in China, is at so much. It's at it's at 005, which is like midnight. So if you sit in the very first row in that theater and you watch that very first screening, the light from the film reaches your eyes before anybody else in the entire country. And because China has an early screening compared to in the States, you're the first general audience member to ever see the, the film. In the, world, yeah. in the world, in the world, the I'm first sure general show, audience. The the, yeah, the actors have seen yeah. it and the approval people have seen it and all that, but you would be the first person to watch the film as a general no, audience. You would be biggest Marvel fan that. right here. This is I the am literally not. He, <laughs> how, no, um, tell me it's not 90 minutes. The it's average not. movie. It's it usually is. about. It's it used to be in the 1950s. Between two hours and two hours. No wonder I hate movies so much. Oh Wait, but you're so literally long. in film class right no, now. No, but they're so. Leo. Leah, you're literally in film yeah, class right now. This whole like Vietnam trip thing has got me really tired and it's messed up my whole entire schedule. I got a test this afternoon. I didn't even look at math. But yeah, this is just my usual lunch break at home. I gotta head back in like 20 minutes, which is not a lot of time for eating. I just finished my math mock exam. Um, I fell asleep in the middle because I was so tired. Every year in Beijing around this springtime, all of the, these trees, they release this like white fluffy stuff in the air everywhere. And I'm like kind of allergic to it. Just a little bit and it makes my nose like really uncomfortable and it's just flying around everywhere. Check this out. So just all this stuff like flying in the air. It literally gets everywhere, look at this. Covered in all this like white fluffy stuff. Today has just been really tiring and dizzy. Like I, I've... I've been half asleep all day. These are the awards we got at the Across Asia Youth Film Festival. Here, so I put the, the red things behind it so you can see the text more clearly, but this one's best film 16 to 18 category. This one is best cinematography. And then this one is best AAYFF film. So this one's the best picture, the biggest one of them all, the best overall film of all films. These are really heavy by the way, like this looks really light but it's actually like extremely heavy. I literally like lug these on the plane in my carry-on this whole time. That's why yesterday was really tiring. I'm gonna go do something now that doesn't require my brain because my brain is dead and I'm about to fall asleep. McDonald's. Stop! McDonald's! I don't eat McDonald's. I'm not 